Okay, I think it just. Okay. It did not. I think the key has to be like closer. Not. Here, go. Is the battery dead? Pushing. Wait, let me try to put my foot on. No. No. See, now it's turning red. It says ACC mode. Yeah. Oh, there we go. Yeah, when I show her this, she's gonna. Yeah, she's probably gonna want to come right down here. Huh? I like, I like using. I, I want to like, you know, because see, the thing about it is, you, I gotta get comfortable with a steering wheel before I even try to use the buttons on that. That's pretty cool. Let's see, I wonder what the. Let's see, the, uh, this should, should be one for setting up the radios like uh oh, here it is. Yeah, that's pretty, that's pretty decent. Sounds better than my uh, aunt's Nissan Ultima. She just bought an Ultima and, and she was like complaining her stereo is not that good. Yeah, because she got like a 2.5S. You know, that was the base. She didn't get like the one with the infinity sound system. Only if you spend the money. She got the two, she got the base model Nissan Ultima. If you spend the money, you get a lot of stuff out of it. Let's go over see what else is there. No playable device. Yeah, but that's pretty cool that it comes with um, the touchscreen. I only, I only wish that it came with the nav system as a base model. Because I figure if they put this in, then they should give you a nav system too. And then just have you pay for the other features like the, you know, the blue link thing. Uh, yeah. No, it has it, but what I'm saying, it comes, the Bluetooth comes standard, but here's the thing, the navigation system doesn't come standard. See, navigation, oh, you gotta buy that tech package for that nav system. So, it's like, if they're giving, I, I like the fact that they're starting to give you these screens, but I figure it's like this. You should also have the nav system in there because that's not even all it is is an antenna added to the screen basically. It's an antenna and a little computer. But Yeah, this thing is this is pretty nice. In fact, I hope they do that for the Sonata. I hope they start giving you stuff like that for the Sonata though. Because I always like the Sonata. The Sonata the, the Sonata comes fully equipped. I don't even want to treat it's called Prefer Equip. However, if you guess on it, they get it like that. Hmm. Oh, now it comes just like this. All in. But the Sonata doesn't have a screen like that. It does? It comes like, but no, but does it come like that standard yet? Basically. You gotta pay for that. Yeah, you gotta pay for that. Mm. It's just certain models that come like that. Yeah, right, exactly. But nah, but their new cars are pretty their new cars are pretty good. Their new cars are pretty good. Cause they they just like give you so much stuff now. When you're staring down a yeah, that's cool. and the cheese is melting and the juicy ground beef is spilling out the end. They're also calling prime If you do me a favor, walk behind the car, because I think when... Everybody behind. 
Oh snap, that's cool. Yeah, you No, but you can hear it when they walk near the sensor, it, it, it like beeps. That's pretty that's pretty awesome. Here's the screwing on the cross Bronx yeah, eastbound. Awesome. Right around the area in the Deegan, an accident knocks out the left lane. Awesome. And Brooklyn Columbia Street still remains closed down both ways. Water main break between Bay and Sigourney Street. In the eastbound, a crash ties things up around 43 and Precipity and Sawmill Northbound by the throughway in Greenberg. Right lane's blocked from the crash. Mass transit, great shape, and believe it or not, behind your Oh, you want to get in? Get in. Oh, get in, get in. <laughs> this report brought to you by Strauss Auto Tire Service and more. Change your own oil, stop by Strauss Auto and get $15 back by mail when you buy five quarts of Mobile One synthetic oil and a Mobile One oil filter. And it's that ultra view sunroof. It's a pretty cool roof. Have a traffic tip? And that's the rear seat. That's the rear view out the back. You know, it's a little bit tough to see out the back. But the car does have a large windshield uh, for the top, so this way it's easy to, you know, look out and get a lot of sunlight in. But when you're looking out the back, that's all you see back there. So rear view is hurt a little because of the, the way the hatchback is designed. Fortunately, you get the camera, so if you have the camera, you throw it. For a cup holders, I think cans and put you can put a can in there. No, you really can't put too much in there. But you can put stuff in there. That's the inverter. 